Et here we go C'est pour les âmes, day, day two. Uh, day one was... I, I can't... I can't even talk right now. So yeah, this is gonna be a good day. Uh, Evan, Carl, Jasper. Uh, yeah, it's gonna be amazing. see you and judge you. <laughs> so uh, I'm going to be talking on character design and how it pertains to world design today. Um, I'm going to talk a minimum about myself uh, just so we get that through it and then we can go and get on with the fancy bits. So Evan, hi. Hello. Uh, how are you? He's doing alright, just finished my demo. So. Yeah, that was amazing. Thank you. So yeah, the first question, uh, why do you teach? Um, I think it has to do with the community that we're in. Um, everyone has gotten a hand up somewhere, so yeah. it's about like paying it forward to like the new generation of, of uh, students and, and uh, artists. And I think everyone sort of learns differently, but if people sort of concertedly try and help each other, we can grow better as a community. Yeah. Nice. I hope that didn't sound too heavy. No, that's, that's amazing. And speaking about the learning, you have some uh, specific thoughts about uh, studying, the way you approach it. Can you like explain? Yeah, there's a, there's a, the general uh, thing that goes on when people study. And they tend to like just copy for the sense of copying, um, which makes it really pretty picture, but you don't really learn it. So the entire idea of like studying with a purpose is to break down what the goal of the study is before you start, yeah. and then fulfilling that as best as you can throughout the studying process. Nice. Uh, can you talk to us about your personal project? Your idea? Yeah, so last year I did um, 366 sketches, one per day in a leap year. Um, and now we're turning it into like three books. Uh, we call it Titan. It's, uh, it's a Norwegian word. It means either draw, uh, it can mean a mark or a sign, or it can mean an omen. So it's very sort of apt to the sort of loose fantasy thing. Okay. And it's more or less like a, a, a world creation yeah. thing where I'm trying to so kind of just take fantasy back to its original ideas and see how you can sort of redevelop them in an interesting way. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's kind of what time is. And uh, is there any chance that in like the future we can play the game thing on like PS6 or something? I'd love that. Having played like Breath of the Wild. Yeah. Not, oh. not, not to hype that shit too much, but <laughs> I love that game. Uh, and I would like seeing an iteration of that with like a world level height design. That would, yeah. I, I would, I would freak out. That okay. Would be cool. I want to play your game. So. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you. Cheers, man. And uh, yeah, that was amazing. you for the talk Hi, first of all welcome. and yeah I wanted to take like two minutes of your time to ask you some questions yeah and the first one is uh, why do you teach why do I teach yeah yes. teach because people tell me they want to hear me teach yeah I was a little uh, lack, lacking in confidence to do this kind of thing but 
it seems like uh, there's a real interest in it now which was something I didn't have when I was you know growing as an artist so to do this online thing makes it so accessible for people that you know uh, it's a good opportunity to kind of look at what you do as well as an artist yes. and assess it and you know it can make you as a, a better artist in your own right. Okay. Uh, I heard that you taught yourself how to paint? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, okay. yeah. So I went to uni but they weren't so interested in the way I was yeah. painting and my figurative style. But So I just kind of taught myself. Nice. And uh, it's actually interesting because I had the, the same story except I didn't taught myself. And like, what would you, would you say to the, the students who are in our school right now but are not learning the, the proper things to, to paint? Like, I guess uh, there's no real straight answer, but the, the information's out there if you want it. And if you talk to other artists and like-minded individuals, you can visit museums and study these things in the flesh. There's so many ways to improve and, and, and grow as an artist. And, you know, the, the information's out there, especially with the internet. A lot of this stuff you can find out online. So it's, it's you know, you've just got to have the drive and passion to, to look for it, I think. Nice, nice. Well, that's all. Okay, great. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Nice to meet you. Thank man. you. <laughs> Take care. originals with me I'll put them up here and you I invite you to come up and look at them and you can th then I bet if you look at this what we just did and you just look at the other one you can see it all makes sense now I know how we did it this is all my tricks you now know exactly what to do <laughs> so thank you so much for coming thank you for uh, was your first workshop? Yeah, yeah, this is my first workshop. So, like, how is it? Amazing. I yeah. mean, like, all the educators. Yeah. Uh, amazing, obviously. But, uh, like, the social aspect yeah. about it is really amazing as well. Like, meeting artists, because I don't really uh, have that many in my vicinity where I live. Yeah. So, just meeting people and getting to know them and talking about art is just so inspiring. So, like, oh, can't wait to, like, get home and sit at my computer. Yeah. <laughs> 
for hours and hours and hours. Nice. Will you uh, come back? Definitely. Yeah. Absolutely, yeah. yeah. Nice. Thank you. <laughs> This is recording. Oh. <laughs> now you have to talk. Yoo-hoo, hello guys. <laughs> so, did you like the workshop? It's amazing. It's always amazing. It's like a must every year, right? To come to school with him. Yeah? Yeah, absolutely. Like, uh, how many workshops uh, have you done? I've been there for the last three ones. Nice. Uh, the one that was like last year and three years ago. Oh, nice. I didn't see you last year. Yeah. I didn't see anyone last year. <laughs> nice. It's so, awesome. you will be here last uh, next year? Absolutely. <laughs> the mighty build. <laughs>